astrotometry log. It is February 3rd, 2010. It's approximately 10.05 UTC. This is a earthquake watch for the northern hemisphere and I'm going to produce a watch for this particular coronal hole. I'm going to label this coronal hole 1043 after the sunspot that it sits under. And this sunspot, this active region here on the sun, has a potentially correlated cloud pattern near Algeria. And this region right here is one of the few that sits near the latitude, the expected latitude of the event, that is also around a seismically active area. The area right here, you can see where the water is, is similar in shape to the coronal hole. So you can see these seas that surround the area here have a, a similar shape to the coronal hole itself. And so this is the most likely correlated area also because there is a fault here. And I was unaware that Algeria was seismically active, but it has had several quakes in the past 10 years that were um, had fatalities in the thousands. This quake, I'm not sure how big it's going to be. It could easily be uh, six plus based on the fact that it uh, shows up in the other frequencies. Seems like a sort of maybe a, a, a significant event. But since this is only the second image I've had since the CCD bakeout on the SOHO satellite, I don't know when this started forming and I don't know if it's shrinking right now or if it's still growing. And so I'll probably do a follow-up to this video. Uh, the other possible places for this quake, um, the cloud top map here from the U.S. Naval Research Laboratory also shows a pattern right here that is similar. And so it also could be on either side of the Red Sea. And see there's also a fault line that runs along here. And so it could be along here, but that doesn't match this other pattern. The best match is this this area right here uh, based on the the shape of the magnetic fields um, probably around here maybe to the east of Algiers could be to the west of Algiers um, but that's a these are this is this is speculative highly speculative but that seems to be what's indicated from uh, the shape of this. I'll do another log um, trying to deal with this or speculate on this larger coronal hole uh, sometime soon.